everyone. My last video I showed you these two trays and I'd been away for a couple of weeks so that the, they had lost a little bit of colour because I left them under the patio and um, so I've just put them out in some morning sunlight and it's really helped pop out the colours again. See, look at these, these are really pretty. These are my random trays because I didn't take the time to label the leaves and um, so I just throw random ones in there. And I do recycle a lot of food containers. I find them to be really good trays. So I just thought I'd show you some other trays I didn't show you last time. They're doing really well. And again, I've given them a little bit of direct sunlight. Not a lot, because not all of them have roots yet. But this tray is coming up really well. They're grabs. Grabs grow really easily in sedums. And then dozers, again, a cute little blush of pink, which is nice. This is my favourite tray. This is a grab, and they're called Mile Pin. And there's quite a lot in there. So I'm really excited about potential potentially having a lot of plants and here are a few more hang on my headphone cord is caught I try my best to keep them um, sorted out by what plant they are you can see here these are all bento box containers which I really like because they've got different little segments these are looking really good too yeah, all right, so if you recall on one of my first videos I did, I have a shelf and I've, I put my leaves in there in recycled food containers and I did this through winter to sort of help keep the process going. So I'm not too sure what I'm going to do when it's peak summer because they might get a little bit too warm, but at the moment they're still doing well and I thought I might want to have a look inside some of them show you what's going on. This is really awkward because one hand is holding my phone and so I can only do this with one hand. Um, so what's going on in here? So you see the soil is really dry. This is a new tray so not much happening yet. Um, I'll just put that to the side. Let that clip off. These are looking good. They're getting a little little babies again see there's no water on the soil I only do that if there's a lot of roots in there but they just naturally get condensation so I don't feel like they really need a lot of water I really need to get my nails redone I'm so sorry um, it's not really exciting, it's a bit of a process, it takes a while for something to really happen. Okay, let's make some space. Oh, this is a good one. See, they've got a lot of nice pink air roots. They st still need a bit of time. This is a sedum. There's a little bit of moisture on the soil there. I did spray this one because there are some roots. But I'm hesitant to do that because I don't want the leaves to get all monkey and, and wet, which can happen when you have a lid on them. This is doing well. Look, they've got some nice air roots. Little babies are coming. No, oh, that one's got a bit of bird shit. Yeah. Oh, that's doing good. Oh, I'll do one more stack. Hang on, I'm grabbing a stack. Oh, my washing's done. I'll take care of that in a minute. Oh god, so hard doing this one-handed. Again, that's quite a new tray. There's one that's got a baby. You really got to be patient with propagation. There, there are a lot of rewards, but uh, if you don't have a lot of time in your hands, um, which fortunately I do. This is good. Look, that's got a nice baby grana. Lots of air roots. 
There's that. That's just some pearl light. I like that one. They're doing well. That last one. This is really awkward. Looks like these are some sort of grab. Yeah, grabs grow really easy. Let's see our roots. Doing really well. Anywho, so that's my station. It's my propagation station. Alright, ciao people.